Hi guys, this is Charles. I'm one of the surgeons at South Paws. These are the post-op radiographs on the uh, Labrador that we repaired the radius ulna fracture yesterday. And when we look, uh, this is the lateral view, obviously. Uh, so we've got all this comminuted fracture down here. That fissure fracture was extending kind of down in this direction. We've got a nice cerclage wire on there and it seems to be reduced really nicely. I have three screws below, three screws above, so six cortices above and below. Um, if I could critique uh, my repair, my screws are a little bit long, all of them. Uh, all of my uh, screws are a little bit long, and, uh, and that's probably just because I added a couple of millimeters to the length, and my depth gauge is already showing that the, um, that the screws were a little bit long. So looking at my uh, cranial caudal view, we've got really nice alignment proximally and distally. We've got our cerclage wire in place. We can see that we've got comminution there and we haven't completely reduced that comminution, which is fine. We've done more of a biological repair than we've done a um, biomechanical repair. I mean a biomechanical repair, biological repair rather than biomechanical repair. Um, so everything is going to be very stable. Um, no screws close to the joint, but um, uh, I haven't gotten perfect alignment of all of my fracture fragments, which is fine. Um, if we go back into um, the CT scan, let's see if we can um, do our 3D volume rendering. So we can look at that fracture again. I'll just pull that up. So, uh, so this was the fracture here. Um, so that's what it looked like beforehand. Um, so you can see that one little fissure heading down um, distally. Let me just see if I can bring that closer. So you can see that one little fissure heading down distally. So I'm happy with the repair that we've done. Uh, this dog should do really well. We're going to restrict activity for um, about eight weeks um, and repeat radiographs at that time.